Hi babe buddies and welcome back to my YouTube channel Kelly Prepster Studio. My name is Kelly and I'm so happy you clicked on this video. Today I'm going to be sharing with you guys the behind the scenes of my videos by sharing my desk tour. Every video that I filmed on this channel besides my vlog going to the craft store has been filmed at my desk. I get so many questions and comments asking if I can do a desk tour so that is what today's video is. I'm so excited. If you guys are too be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. Also so be sure to check out my website kellyprepsterstudio.com. I do hand make all of my products and then pack them on camera so it's a really fun way to get like a little shout out when you do shop Kelly Prepster Studio. But I'm so excited to share my desk with you guys because a lot of things have changed especially since I've been filming a lot more lately and then I also have a lot more beads but if you guys would like to see a video of all of my beads, all of my inventory, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Use the hashtag bead buddies in the comments down below as well which also if you do use my hashtag bead buddies in the comments there's a chance you will be the comment of the day in my next upcoming video but let's just get right in it to the desk tour so this is a little overview shot of my desk with my desk chair the two drawers on the side are the alex drawers from ikea and then it just has the matching tabletop on it my chair was a facebook marketplace find it is so cute you guys it's from wayfair i believe but it's like this gorgeous pink chair with gold on the bottom i have a little basket to hold all my cords down there and i have this little lily pulitzer pillow with a pink throw blanket tossed on top of it and i love it because it has this fringe on them now my desk is in all of my videos i have done a tour before but never full in depth i want to share with you guys what i keep on this side which is just like office supplies and then this side is all of my beading and bead kits and everything like that so i'm going to give you guys a little overview of the top above my desk i have my baby cave sign which is from Hobby Lobby it's so cute then I have my July calendar I try my best to keep it organized with both of my channels so we're just going to skip over that because it has all of my filming stuff on it I did put this super cute little bellow minion sticker on my webcam then I have a ring light over here and this is a desk tripod ring light I've had it forever it is amazing I love these especially for when I'm filming when it's cloudy outside and I can move it but I like to have it sitting on my my desk then I just have this lamp that is from Target it used to tap to turn on but now I have to plug it in each time but it's so cute and then at the bottom of my desk I have this little picture of my husband and I this little rock that I painted during quarantine back in the pandemic it's just so happy and then my dad actually gave me this rock it's so pretty it's just like a really nice white rock so I put it right there I have my acrylic oh, pink stapler I didn't think I was gonna need a stapler but of course I did and then I had to buy a super cute one then I I have this big bowl of pens. I have no idea where this is from. I honestly think it's like a pot for our flowers and I just put all of my favorite pens, markers. I have my scissors in here and I hooked my little blue light glasses on here. Then of course I have my computer where I make all the thumbnails, upload everything. I don't edit my videos on this channel but I do edit them on my other channel. On the bottom of it I have dream it, believe it, achieve it. You can create your own reality. A little quote. I have another picture of a Polaroid of my husband and I. I have a Vineyard Vines whale sticker. I have a Bead Buddy sticker, a Lilo and Stitch stitch sticker, and one of my stickers that says life won't sparkle unless you do. And next to my pens, I keep my phone and I have to take my case off, but I have this charger. It's like a wireless one and you just set it here and it charges, but I love it because it displays my phone, especially when I'm filming. I have a little Stitch plushie, my vlogging camera, my favorite lip combo, if you guys are curious. <laughs> this is the pixie lip balm it's like a lip stain and then i use this merit lip oil and you guys it's such a great combo i have my sd cards for my camera i pulled out these charms that i want to use and they've just been sitting on my desk and then i have a hair clip underneath here i keep my keyboard then on this side i have my mouse pad which is from amazon i love the cheetah print but i like that it's neutral my mouse i have my little business card holder but i need to make some more business cards but i have my jewelry care guides my freebie stickers and my logo stickers then i have my salt lamp my rainbow led lamp and behind that is my rollo printer and that is how i print off my shipping labels and i just kind of rest this on here when i'm not using it and then i have my little alarm clock and i like to have that away from my bed so it makes me get out of bed and then i've been working on these phone cases they're so cute i'm learning how to make them so these might be on the shop very soon they're just so adorable and they've just been sitting on my desk and then of course my most recent purchase of 
love my clay beads. I did a huge haul and unboxing and organizing video of all of these. They're really heavy and embarrassingly enough, I don't have any room in my shelving unit to put these away so they've just been sitting on here. They are seriously so heavy and sometimes when I film, I just place them on my vanity. But we are gonna go through the bead drawers. This first drawer has my pony beads plus my little scoops over here. I wanna do a whole video sharing all of my beads but this video would be way too long for that and it just has three pony bead trays plus the tray that I use to measure and it's really simple and stays just like that then in this drawer it's a little chaotic but I have all of my elastics plus my favorite one and I keep all of my charms in here these are just organized charms and then I have my jump rings I have the European links plus this jewelry wire I have some clamp beads then back there I have bangles I have all of my pliers and tools to use and I have some more bangles and charm bracelets in here then this is just miscellaneous I literally throw everything in here we have hoop earrings, post earrings, needles, glue, bracelets that don't work, and then some little smiley faces and clasps. It's really random. Then in this drawer, I keep all of my stickers, and I probably need to find a new way to organize these, but I have all my stickers, some packaging, my off-season stickers and then my sticker packs and it's just in a little desk drawer organizer. I have a lot more of these clay string beads that didn't fit into this big case so they're just in there. Then I have my bead spinner. I'm kind of embarrassed I didn't clean it out but that's just sitting right there. And then my Alex drawers hold six of these in the back. So I have all my letters, my European colorful beads and just like more beads back there. It's kind of a hot mess, you guys, but it is organized. And then this one is my massive bead drawer. So I just picked up this necklace measure and I put it in here. But again, I have two more of these. I have this little thing of keychains that I'm going to use. I have some glass beads. I have seed beads. And these have to stay this way because they will spill. And then I have some letters. I have some more glass beads from Hobby Lobby. I have my first ever clay bead kit, some seed beads, these super cute little rhinestone beads, and this miniature clay bead kit. And they just fit in here perfectly. And then the drawer that I've never shared, this is my packaging drawer. And honestly, I need to restock because I need some more organza bags. I have these little holographic bags that I'm going to be using for bead confetti. I have envelopes for stickers, my thank you cards, more envelopes, my packaging stickers, thank you cards, extra elastic, washi tape, and then more washi tape in the back. And that is everything on this side. If you guys would like to see a video about all of my beads, be sure to let me know in the comments down below. And we're going to move over to this side. I'm going to say this side's not as organized, but I have these little drawer organizers. I have random stickers back here, my Sharpies, some sewing stuff, a ruler, a hole punch, my earring packaging, a squeegee. I'm kind of embarrassed. This is so random. I have gum, staples, tape, push pins, random office supplies. This is full of nails and stuff for hanging decor, SD cards, and like flash drives. Then I have this drawer and I keep my five minute journal and my iPad in here. I have my vitamins, posty notes, and my favorite pens that I like to put in my purse sometimes. So this is like my most used stuff. Then I have my tech drawer and this is just a hot mess. I didn't know where to put all of this stuff. So I have my Canon little mini printer, a iPhone charger, a portable charger, lots of camera batteries, battery chargers for my cameras, random cords, my Beats headphones, some more computer charging stuff. Honestly, I should put this over here. I'm always looking for one of those. And I have my Yeti mic. This drawer is my nail drawer. If you guys didn't know, I do my nails at home and I love it. I've been using this brand Manicurist and you guys need to check it out because it is so easy and it comes with this solution. So I do my at home gel nails. You put this stuff on it, it peels it off, which that's always been the struggle. So I have a little heat thing. Then down here is again, super random. I'm kind of embarrassed. I have my scale, more of these for my claw machine, markers, and Rolo paper plus more beads. 
but that is everything in my desk it is wild it's a little messy but it's organized i know where everything is but i hope you guys enjoyed this video be sure to give it a big thumbs up if you guys liked it let me know in the comments down below what your desk is like if you have any video requests and be sure to use the hashtag bead buddies which speaking of here is the comment of the day thank you guys all so much for watching my videos and leaving such sweet and positive comments it seriously means the world to me and we are so close to 5,000 subscribers which is seriously so crazy because earlier this week i had just said thank you for 4,000. so thank you thank you thank you i am so excited for the bead buddies community and i hope you guys have been enjoying my content thank you so much for watching don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below and i'll see you guys back here very soon with another new youtube video bye guys